Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and somebody sent me this. He's making a template for a router, and when the laser starts right here, I don't know what he's cutting out of, but probably MDF and... Um, it's got a little bitty bump there from the start. And he's using a router, so the corners need to be particularly perfectly round and not a little bump. Um, I've never even thought about this, but we could put the starting point in the middle, so, and I think would help. So I'm gonna double click and make a node. I'm gonna go up here, I'm gonna right click, I'm gonna break apart, I'm gonna go up here and right click and break apart. And then I'm going to right click and I'm gonna join. And then I'm actually gonna right click and turn this into a smooth node. And I'm actually gonna go here and right click and turn and join those. So now here's your starting point. That's where the laser is gonna start. This is the, where the laser is gonna stop. This should help, because it, you know, even if this has a little bitty bump, you could minutely sand it. If people don't, if you don't understand what's happening, use a router with a, with a ball bearing on it, and the ball bearing rides on this template, and then it's a, uh, it's called a pattern bit, and it will cut this exact pattern out perfectly. I've never even thought about that problem. I've cut out a lot of uh, templates for patterns and, and never thought about, I've never, I, I don't think my laser puts a little bump when it starts, but I don't know what he's cutting it out of. Uh, you know, he's cutting something out of, you know, more than a quarter inch MDF maybe the light beam or something, I don't know. And I'm really curious if this is gonna help him. I hope he emails me back. Anyway, hope that helped. Thank you for watching.